gentlemen and ladies. Ladies, ladies. <laughs> Welcome to Bell Art Attractions, BAA, your weekly guide to the art scene in this beautiful city of Belgrade. With me, Nella and Boyana here together. That's my name. Mm -hmm. We're your hosts. Are you going to see any any art stuff this week? Every week, baby. Every, every week. Every week. We want to keep the arts alive in Belgrade, so support them. There's lots of um, protective measures in place, so you stay safe. So don't let anything stop you. Do go and, and see a play or an exhibition. Um, everything has been taken care of. Yeah, yeah. Support, support them. And support us by subscribing to our channel. So... Go ahead and hit the subscribe button here. And uh... and if you know of any events that you think we need to highlight, do give us an email at bellartattractions at gmail.com or belgradeartnews at gmail.com. Yeah. Shall we do it? Let's do it. Let's Yay. get into it. So to start us off tonight with films, the Merlinka Classics Festival at the Yugoslav Cinematique in Markaveev Hall on Uznamirkova 1 Good is one. happening. <laughs> you got it. She got it. <laughs> These names sometimes. But uh, this film festival is happening from the 12th to the 15th of November. Um, it's featuring eight films uh, about the LGBTQ community. Wow. These are really important films because that's what got us uh, sort of started and introduced uh, the themes of LGBTQ and, and queer film uh, that really paved the way for what we see today on, on TV shows, on Netflix, wherever we may be getting our content. And the whole aim of, of the film festival is to really introduce the younger generation to the history behind these To get a bit of representation as well, yes, to exactly. see some of you know their, their identities on camera. Um, I, what I want to know though, are the films in Serbian or are they international? It's a festival, so it's like in a whole bunch of languages. I think there's some in Italian, some in German, uh, and the list goes on. But if you are interested, do check out the links below. Um, this is happening from 6 p.m. or 8.30 p.m. So do check out the links um, and, and join us. Yeah, see you there. So starting off this week with a bang and with a meow, it's not cats, don't let this confuse you, but it is another machka, another cat. The machka, the cat, the famous Siren of the 1980s, Lepa Brenna. It's going to be a play about her life where five women are going to showcase Lepa Brenna through five stages of her career in the 80s. I remember her. Do you remember any songs? Mm, I'm really bad at singing. You know, to, 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 I'm not going to continue. She had the I'll longest legs. She had the longest legs. She was the biggest pop star of the 80s i do i remember i have some vhs tapes of films that have like don't a we music all? video don't we all? <laughs> maybe if you're not serbian you don't but if if you're really if you're interested to to look at one of our greatest pop stars of the 80s catch the lepa brenna project at bitev theater and on terrazia 29 straight in the center of town it's next Tuesday, 17th of November, it starts at 8 p.m. And get in early, book your tickets online and you get 5% off. Mm, so check the links out. Hi, the Dasa volume up. Okay. I'm going to sing with you. <laughs> so, Boyana. Yes. You know what else is happening at Bitev Theatre? Bitev. <laughs> I like steak, Bitek theater. On, on Bitek, sorry. It's not Bitek, Bitek, sorry. If you stopped interrupting me, I could tell them what's happening there. It's not a talking piece, it's a physical theater piece, which means that the entire message is brought across physically. Nice. So anyone can go watch it, even though all the text will be in Serbian. So what is this piece about? Explores super existential themes, like what if the soul is just a way of thinking? Almost. Wow. Yeah, almost like an algorithm. If we come across our 
our ways of thinking and we put across what, what we feel as, as a computer algorithm does. And what's great about this physical piece is it uh, incorporates a lot of multimedia, so a lot of projections on the screen. Sounds stuff. very matrixy to me. Super matrixy and really explores the themes of AI. Something what I, I like the sound of that is that a lot of us overthink these things and the way that this is presented is very visual. So it allows us to explore these themes yeah. outside of our minds. And really puts the future of AI into perspective in, in an easily digestible way. Is, do you think AI is going to be a threat to humanity? Well, I don't know. Listen to what Elon Musk has to say. Oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> Don't think so. <laughs> anyway, that's that's on at 8 p.m. on the 19th and 20th of November. So uh, links in uh, in the links below, you'll find it and uh, get all your information there. We'll see you there. Now, moving on to a venue we may not have mentioned before, Atelier 212, which is on Svetogorska 21. There will be a play which is going to be co-produced with Teater Vuk. Got a little wolf uh, here. The play is called Roska Smrt, which means Russian death. Dum, dum, dum. And what it is about, it is about two sisters, Valya and Nadja who live their Russian death trapped between a past of woven disappointment and a hazy future they can hardly hope for. Something that unfortunately we are all too familiar with in the Balkans. But what we're also familiar with here is the way we can turn around a dark situation with humour. So expect with this play there are a lot of tough themes but there are, there's, there's a lot of laughs thrown in. It will be held in Serbian. Sorry, did you want to ask something? Yes, I wanted to say that Blue Glove Speeches might want to watch this, even though there are some horror themes. It seems to be a little lightened because you know she doesn't like yes. horror. Yes. No. Horror no. Films. Well, I mean, this is this is kind of realist, but it's it's you can find the humor in anything. So you it's, should. It's, yeah, it's the way we we have, or, you know, in, in the Balkans, the way we've survived. And this is the play will be held in Serbian. So if you don't know Serbian, bring your Serbian friend along so they can explain to you what's happening. Um, so I didn't tell you, it's this Sunday, 15th of November at 8 p.m. And the tickets are either 700 or 1,000 dinars wherever you sit. So do check that one out. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds good. Yeah. We'll see you there. Yeah. Can I stick this knife in you? Sure. Ah! No, no thanks. <laughs> <laughs> what is that for? Oh, there's another play. Uh, I'm following you with venues and, uh, and artificial intelligence today, but there's another play uh, at Atelier 212 on Svetozoska 21 right. called Testirano na Ljodima. It's a bit early for that, isn't it? <laughs> So it's tested on people. Now, this is kind of up my street again. AI mixed with reality TV. <laughs> In other words, futures made of virtual insanity. I'll stop right now. Yeah, she's full of song today. It just trigger me. It just triggers me. It's because you're next to me, you know. It's vibey, it's fun, it's great. It's, it's almost as good. As, as being at the play. As being at the play. Um, Not better. Anyway, so tickets are going for 700 to 1,000 dinars, depending on where you sit. And the whole play uh, looks at putting a group of eight characters to, together in sort of their... Is it like a big brother thing? ...imprecise coexistence, but brings in these themes of virtual reality. Um, and testing on people <laughs> in sort of virtual zoo environments, is that it? Yeah, 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 it sort of looks at how reality TV plays out and what is real and what isn't and what is artificial intelligence and, and how the two sort of blend together. So does it look behind the psychology of, of that, would you say? Yeah, yeah, I would say that, but I'd have okay. to see the play to confirm it for you. So suggest really you go see, see this play. Um, 
yeah, links links below with all the information. I have to tell you that uh, the spoken words will be in Serbian, but if you're like myself and Bojana, you know, we get by on both languages. I'm sure it'll be very visual. Uh, yeah, extremely <laughs> visual. If you want to see yeah. a, a, a theatrical look set in the subtext of reality television, I suggest that you go see that. That's when? On Monday? That's on the 16th of November. That's on Monday. That's on Monday. Yes. See you there. So what we've all been waiting for, or what you, the audience, have been waiting for is the premiere of Audience. That is the premiere of Publica, translated into audience. I got the joke now. Yeah, you, you got it? I got the joke. Audience, uh, audience. Yes. Anyway, well, <laughs> this play is about chess. And I have to tell you, just a little pre-story, it's nothing to do with the play, but my father, who's kind of a, a Sean Connery type, he always used to tell me, and that means life is chess. Beware of each move. And this play explores that actually, it explores how we, maybe not us, but other little people, pawns, as we put it, um, go through life in a tragic comic way, as we love these tragic comedies and black comedies here in the Balkans. Because they speak to our life. They do. We they just really get do. it. We yeah. just get it. Yeah. So yes, it explores the humorous way that people don't think with their own heads. And where are our places in life, in life's game of chess? Basically, we do not make any decisions ourselves. We think we do. I don't know, maybe you're, you're, you're a king, maybe you're a bishop, maybe you're a pawn. Go and see this I'm, player to I'm see who queen. you are. I'm a queen. Okie dokie, well... Which means I always fall for the king. Yes, <laughs> so then I'm the king. I'm the king. <laughs> this play, it's going to be held at uh, Academia 28 on Nemanjina 28. And it's next Thursday, the 19th of November at 8pm. Everything seems to be starting at 8pm everywhere. So you've got a whole week, a whole week to go and get your tickets, which are 1,200 dinars. And the play will be in Serbian, but we do expect it's going to be quite a visual feast. So go and check it out. Do you know what uh, Steve and, and the next act have in common? No. A one man show. We're ending off on a very light-hearted note with two stand-up comedy acts coming up. Oh. We need a bit of laughter, come on. Yeah, yeah. Yes, we do. Both presented at the Benekiba Comedy Club. Yeah. That's okay. on Brace Krismanovića. Did I say that right? Krismanovića. Krismanovića, six. Uh, six. Yeah. So tonight, that's this Thursday night, tonight, tonight at 7.30 p.m., Radomir Nestorovic. Not to be, he's not a relative. At least we don't think he is of the relative of the Nestorovic. Is performing Stari Dechak. Old boy. And tickets are 300 dinars. Um, Benakiba Comedy Club, always a, a very fun venue, uh, if you haven't been. And then tomorrow night, that's on Friday, is Srijan Jinjic doing his one-man stand-up show called Treće Stanje, or Third State of Mind? Could be Third Stage, could be Third... Third something or another, but it's, it's a Third State of Being, maybe. I'm a Third Culture kid, so it doesn't really matter. A Third Something. <laughs> Anyway, that starts. Doors open 7 p.m. Benakiba Comedy Club as well, but tickets are 500 dinars for this one. It's a steal. Mm, funny one.
That's all this week at Bell Arts Attractions. I mean, there are loads of things. When you so say. many things. It's really opened what, what, up what, this what, week. Are you, what do you want to see? Uh, Russian Death. That okay. sounds really, really good. And of course, the stand-up comedy. I want to see the uh, premiere publica, the premiere audience, audience with all the chess oh, stuff. Audience. I quite mm. like that. Mm. Yes. Yeah. So yeah, I, we hope to see some of you guys there. If you're there, come and say hello at a distance. Also, if, if, if you want to say hello to us, you know, virtually, you can always email us at bellartattractions at gmail.com. And tell us what you think of our videos. Please, you know, we, we want to hear some feedback. Do, do put in, um, give us your comments. We take criticism too, if you have any suggestions. Uh, if you have an event you want to talk about, you can also email belgradeartnews at gmail.com. So make sure to do that. Hit the subscribe button, please. You can also email, there's another email you can email us at, which is bellartsattractions at gmail.com. Why are you repeating what I said? You said Belgrade Arts News. I We've said, got two emails. Oh my Four, goodness. Two. <laughs> oh. Right, guys, I think that's, that's we, we're done for today, aren't we? We are done. We are done. are done. We are done. I'm never you are done. Hosting with you. Bye. 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 I'm Diana. She's Nella. Bye. Bye.